Hi, I'm Mel and welcome to Mel's mini tutorials. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a very quick wobble effect GIF using Procreate. Okay, so I have a square canvas open in Procreate. I'm not going to go over how to actually create the artwork in this tutorial. Um, I'm going to assume that you have some knowledge about Procreate. So this is the sketch that I was working from. My canvas is 1500 pixels square. Um, and you can see what I've done in my layers is I created um, some colour drops to make this design kind of more interesting. So when I take the sketch away, um, this is the image I've been left with. You can do this for any kind of image. I'm just using the initial of my name, but you can do it with pictures, images, um, anything like that. I've turned the drawing assist off. I wanted it intentionally to have slightly kind of wonky, wobbly feel to it. That's just part of my drawing style. But what is important is that each time you draw your image, you really want it to be slightly different every time. So you don't want it to be super accurate to your sketch. So you can see in my layers, that one I have now over a few different layers. So I'm gonna just merge them together. So you can see now I have the same design five times and it looks slightly different each time. That's why I just used to turn the drawing assist off. So I wanted it to be a little bit different. I can now get rid of my sketch, so I'm just gonna delete the sketch. And then if you go in over into your little wrench icon and then go to share, you'll see that you can make, um, at the bottom here, you can make an animated GIF and then it's gonna give you some options for how sort of quickly those frames are gonna go. So I think this is a little fast for me, so I'm gonna just slow it down. That's fairly okay, maybe a little faster. Um, and you can just say max resolution, that's nine frames per second, so that's fairly fast, but it's not so fast it's kind of giving you a headache. Um, and you can turn dithering off or on, you'll see it makes a tiny bit of difference to the colour palette. Um, so my colours were a little bit desaturated with the dithering um, on, so I'm going to turn that off and then you just simply go export and then procreate just magically creates that gif for you and then you can choose how you want to save it to yourself i usually airdrop things to my mac so i hope that was helpful